The first year anthropology course is split into two sections. So there's a section called 1010 and then another section called 1020. The 1010 section covers both biological anthropology and archaeology and the 1020 section covers cultural anthropology and linguistic anthropology. So the idea is that they're covering the four main subdisciplines of anthropology. So we're talking about humans from all sorts of perspectives, biological, cultural, language, uh, in prehistory, so through archaeology. So we're trying to kind of cover all the bases with the various sections. It's a combination of weekly lectures and weekly seminars. So the students attend a two-hour lecture, um, and there are a variety of formats within that lecture. So some uh, lectures contain films, documentaries, short clips of videos. Uh, some have guest lectures. Some are a combination of all of those things. And then the seminars, uh, the goal for the seminars is to give the students a hands-on opportunity to engage with the materials. If there are a variety of assignments. The idea is that we're trying to, to teach them a variety of skills that are applicable both in anthropology but also in the wider university setting. So there are uh, essay assignments at the end of the 1010 course, so that's the biological and archaeology course. Uh, there is uh, an opportunity to do some thought responses to things that they've read, so short articles or response to a specific question. Uh, then we also have them do a library skills assignment in conjunction with the Bata Library, and that's just to help them learn how to use the library and specifically how to use the library to research anthropology. Uh, and then we have some um, assignments where they're asked to observe members of the community and then write a reflection on those observations. Uh, also some assignments where we're asking them to locate references and then discuss those references. So there, there is a variety of assignments and then in 1010, the Biological Anthropology um, Archaeology course, we have pop quizzes through the, the course. So there are I think five pop quizzes and the lowest mark is dropped. So that's just to encourage students to keep up with their reading, keep up with lecture material and obviously attend lecture as well. So the, the ultimate goal is for us to create students who are engaged with the world, who are thinking about who they are and what it means to be a human being in the world. Um, and ultimately um, that, that will and should make them better university students, it should make for a better university on the whole, but the idea is that we're really encouraging them just to think about who they are and how their life experience might not be everybody else's life experience, that we're all exceedingly unique and that those um, differences are very important. Um, but there are also many similarities that also tie us together. So we really want them to have a much clearer understanding of what it means to be human.